गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन माई डे स्टार्ट एट सेवन ए एम इन द मॉर्निंग विद माई अलार्म क्लॉक गोइंग ऑफ आई दैन चेक माई मोबाइल फोन दिस इज़ अ वेरी बैड हैबिट दैट आई हैव बट आई स्पेंड क्वार बिट ऑफ अ टाइम ऑन माई मोबाइल फोन बिफोर एक्चुअली गेटिंग आउट ऑफ माई बेड एंड गेटिंग रेडी फॉर माई डे सो यर आई एम जस्ट डन विद चेकिंग माई फोन एंड आई एम गोइंग टू गेट रेडी नाउ After waking up the first thing I like to do is opening up my blinds it just allows a lot of sunshine and then here I'm making my bed I like to make my bed ever since we have started working from home because I just feel more productive when my bed is made I know it's weird but I really like doing it Now once I've made my bed the next thing is taking shower This morning I wasn't washing my hair so I'm just tying it up and putting it in a bun and then taking a hot steamy shower just the way I like it. Good morning everyone. I've just come out of shower. I'm getting ready to go to my office. The first thing in my routine after taking a shower is prepping my skin or doing my morning skin time routine. Um for this I'm going to use this glow recipe serum. I recently bought this so I am not quite sure how I feel about it. But let's see. Next up is I'm using this Mario Badescu spray. Um I personally like this one. I think it's really hydrating and it hydrates my dry skin really well. So I just use that. Now the serum that I've used is quite strong and therefore it's recommended to put sunscreen on before leaving your house. But I use sunscreen anyways every day. But if you're using the same serum, make sure you put some sunscreen on. Now I also put some lip balm for my lipstick. Now that's my morning skincare routine. Um up next is selecting the clothes. Now that I'm fully dressed, I will move on to doing my makeup. Now I usually keep it really simple for my office makeup. Um if you want to see how I do my office makeup, comment down below and I'll definitely make one video for you. It's usually under 10 minutes. It's very 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 easy. Once I make up is done, I'm just combing my hair here. Um I'm detangling all the tangles and then just going to uh, straighten my hair, but after this video, I did end up curling a little bit towards the end. With this I'm almost ready. The only thing left is to pack my bag and leave. Uh I'm going to be honest you guys, today I'm going to try and vlog for the first time in public and I'm a little nervous. So, I hope you enjoy this video. and i hope i post this video because i don't know how this is going to go so fingers crossed
now here i am checking my emails and replying to them first thing in the morning i like to do it as soon as i get in the office so that i have a structure to my day honestly i don't know why i chose this day to vlog but it was so busy you guys i was interrupted so many times and i was just in and out of the meeting and therefore i didn't get a chance to vlog that much and therefore i'm doing this voiceover as well so sorry about that and just like that it was time for some lunch i usually get my lunch from home um today i got lentil salad i do like to warm up my lentil salad a little bit before eating it so that's what i'm doing here i'm just going to warm it up and then enjoy my lunch quietly alone <laughs> After my lunch, I just had few meetings and here I am leaving the office, awkwardly vlogging in public. I was so nervous. Now once I'm back home, I usually get ready to go to the gym. I go to the gym at least two to three times a week. Um, so here I'm getting ready to head to my gym. That's the first thing I like to do once I'm back home. Now once I've got my workout in, I'm usually pretty hungry and I straight away get into my dinner preparation. Today I was craving avocado toast and uh, eggs but I absolutely hate the taste of normal avocado. Uh, avocado and therefore I'm making guac here oh my god if you have never tried guac try my recipe it is so good you will not regret it I'm telling you guys um, it is so filling and so good I absolutely love it so here I'm just cutting some avocado and then I'm putting that in a bowl in the meanwhile I've also chopped onions and tomatoes um, then what you have to do is just mash it roughly and then I'm going to put my onions then my tomatoes in the bowl um, and then you can season it anyhow you like I usually like to season it with some salt and then I will also put a little bit of cumin powder that's the key I love putting cumin powder and then to top it off you can also put coriander leaves here but I was out of it so I didn't put it but um, please make sure you put lemon he lots of lemon I put a whole entire lemon in my guac it just takes your guac from zero to 100 trust me and here i'm just mixing everything up it's so easy and delicious and it's so healthy as well now comes the assembly part i'm just taking two toast of rye breads and then i will be putting heaps of guacamole on it i absolutely love this stuff oh my god you guys you have to try this and then once that is done i am going to top it off with an egg now i personally like a sunny side up style of egg but you can obviously do any type of egg you like and then once that is done you can obviously again put some seasoning on it now i personally love spicy therefore i'm putting heaps of chili flakes on it and then i'm going to enjoy this delicious meal oh my god you guys if you haven't tried this meal i would highly recommend doing it Now once I've smashed my dinner, I straight on get into editing. I usually edit for an hour or two hours. I like to um, edit in parts, otherwise it usually takes me four hours or even more depending on my clips to edit at a stretch. And that's why I like to do it a little by little every day. And that's what I'm doing here, just edit, edit, edit. <laughs> Once I'm done with my editing for the day, I like to spend some time with my friends. We are currently watching the show called Shits Creek on Netflix, highly recommended. And once we have watched a few episodes, I then like to call it a night. <laughs> 